Theme song. Theme song. Theme song. Theme song. You know what it sounded? I, I, <laughs> no. That, that was good, but I had, I had, it was, I thought it was going to go somewhere else. I was like, ooh, that sounded good. It was like a good start is all. I was waiting for the beat to drop. No, I was doing Crazy Train. Theme song. Theme song. Theme song. I, I, I. Why didn't you change tones? I don't know. I fear, I hear, I hear fuzz. Well, I hear fuzz too. You know what it is? Your dick. Well, it has fuzz, but it's that fan. Oh, so stupid. You're dumb. You're ugly. Welcome to Just John's John a with a face. sidekick of joy. A side dick of John. John's a dick smelling cock of face. Hey, so while you're looking at that, what's going down? Hi. Hi, both listeners. Hi, both listeners. How are listeners. we? How, I hope we're well. Uh, I'm getting the camera out. We're doing it next week because John's a dick, so we're going to do it. So we're going to show my dick? Yeah. We'll get like two listeners. No, we won't. We'll be like, oh my Nobody God. Nobody wants to hear this shit anymore. It's, so it's been a tiny. year and it's like going downward. <gasps> Don't. Oh my God, you TikTok motherfucker. Like, we can't even do a podcast without you TikToking no, now. Is trying, that what we're doing? I was trying to go to the stupid thing. Uh huh. I wasn't trying to TikTok. Uh huh. But I don't know. I don't pay attention. Pay- mm-hmm. I don't pay attention to listens and shit. Mm hmm. So. We could be losing him. I don't know. Are mm. we? I don't know. Have you looked in a long time? What? Uh, uh, oh, my God. I wasn't listening. <laughs> I wasn't. Just like everybody else, nobody's listening to this Stop. shit. Stop. No, we're getting a lot of listens. That's why I ask you, and you're a... Burr, 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 burr. Oh, my God. The fuck's your problem today? You're a cock sniffer. Oh, my God. Look, what are, are we you done? Doing? Are we doing... What are we are doing? Are we talking about stuff? Or are we going to talk about this I have shit. shit. Well... well do you have anything besides shit? Do you have stories? I have stories. <laughs> <laughs> you know, uh, <laughs> you know what I noticed? What? It's You're like dumb. I'll screenshot or take a picture of something, and I'll be like, "Ooh," uh-huh. and then I'll be like, "Fuck, what did I do that for?" <laughs> I'm like, "I'll take a picture. I won't forget that way." <laughs> and you but forget. let me tell you, I am getting closer. Uh-huh. At getting better at notes because this week I was like, I'm going to write that down. And then I didn't. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> so normally I just go, ooh, I'll remember. But this time I was like, I need to write that down so I don't forget. I'm like carrying you. Like, Come on, get on my back. Let's go, monkey. <laughs> you fuck a, you monkey fucker. <laughs> yep. That's me. We go to the monkey position. What is the monkey position? <laughs> I don't know, but we're going to end up doing it tonight because we're so I'm going to have to Google this shit out of that. Well, yeah, you made me scissor. We're trying the monkey. <laughs> oh, shit. So speaking of screenshots, so um, I've been looking at animals because I want a chicken, and um, I was looking at the Castaic Animal Shelter, and I'm pretty sure a romance reader is has been naming. All the animals, because <laughs> there's a cat. Are they like Brock and shit like that. <laughs> there's a cat named Christian Gray. Oh Jesus! <laughs> there's probably a Jesus cat too, but no. And then I think there was one called Gideon Cross. I was fucking. I took a screenshot of it because I was like, "Holy shit! Somebody's naming a cat Christian Gray." Like it made me giggle. That is funny. And then, um. So, Brody has been learning the states for fifth grade because <laughs> America, that's what we teach our kids. Fucking oh, my God. I just, I, I wrote a note. Boom, I have a note. Okay. Do I finish or are we just so excited you have a note that we're just going to segue in back to John? Go. No, I don't want to. I don't want to tell you my note now. You're such a dick. I knew you were going to be a dick today. Like, I felt it in my bones. I was like, John's going to be a dick this whole podcast. You know what's weird is I was like, oh, my God, Joy's going to be a douche this whole podcast. <laughs> no. How many <laughs> words went through your head before douche came out? I could, the only douche was the only one I could <laughs> say. <laughs> That's like... <laughs> to I where a, we could still love each other. <laughs> I, had a, I had a patient once, and he's married, and we were talking about COVID, And I was like, yeah. And he's like, I'm going to, it was when we could take our masks off for that like week. 
And he's like, yeah, I took my mask off. And I go, well, you're not going to catch it from me. And I was like, and he's like, oh, well, we're safe. And I'm like, yeah, I can lick your. And I went through the whole fucking body. I was like, oh, my God, what can I say that I can lick that's not going to be sexual? Nothing. Eyeball. That's the only one I, I was like, eyeball. And then his wife came in the next day and she's like, so you're going to lick my husband's eyeball? I was like, the only thing I could think of that was safe. You're like going to fire off something funny and then you're like halfway through. Oh, my God. Uh, I was like, uh, dead t- end. Dead end. Dead end. No breaks. No breaks. <laughs> Knee, leg, toes, foot. It's like you were uh, in the vinegar uh, strips. I was. I was like, you're in the vinegar eyeball. Strips. That's hilarious. Well, anyways. Okay. So Brody is learning the States. And he's a little stressed out about it. And I was like, dude, let me tell you something. You are never going to go to a job interview where they're like, excuse me, sir. Do you know all the states of the United States, where they are and the state capital? That's the only way you're going to get hired as a custodian. (laughs) And he's all, mom, you never know. And I'm like, oh, I fucking know. I know. So anyway, he's getting And I was all. Can you imagine that? "Um, So, Mr. Uh, Barnett, um, (laughs) this is your first time applying here at Six Flags? Magic Mountain? Yes, yes, that is okay. Um, do you know what the capital of Illinois is? <laughs> oh, oh my God! He he goes into a panic. He's like, oh, San Francisco. San Francisco. <laughs> well, I, and then he's like, he would he's doing this test, and I'm like, Wyoming, and he would like go, and he's all, is that right? I'm all, fuck if I know. I don't know where Wyoming is, Alabama. Like, it's a hodgepodge in the middle that I don't know. I've seen pictures of it. I was like, I don't know. Online. Well, anyway, so we get to North. Okay, first we get to South Carolina, and he's like, oh, I can't remember. I can't remember. And I'm all, it's where you get your coffee and your Coke. And he's all, Columbia. I'm all, fucking kid smart. Oh, and then I coke. Coffee and your Coke, Columbia. <laughs> and then he was oh, all. Oh, my God. That kid knows way too much. And then I go, what about Virginia? And he's like, Mom, don't say that. And I'm all, well, it's right next to West Virginia. And he's like, stop saying that. So anyways, we get to North Carolina, and he's all, Ral High. And I go, what? It's Ral High. And I'm like, okay, fucking cool. But then we get to my favorite. Which was R- Raleigh, right? Raleigh, yeah. Okay. Or Raleigh, Raleigh, whatever you it's call Raleigh. it. Raleigh. Raleigh. Well, anyway, we get to Iowa. And he looked at me and goes, Des Moines. <laughs> Des Moines. <laughs> and, it, and he was all proud. He, like, was, he nailed it. He was huh? all Des Moines. And I go, I'm never going to correct him. And then I started thinking about it, and I was actually talking to Jenny and Derek, and I was telling them about the Des Moines, and they're like, well, that sounds super fancy. Like, oh, I went on my, where'd you guys go on your honeymoon? Des Moines. That's like the, how we name our street and who we're talking to. We talk to family. We live on Verdale. We talk to, like, our fancy friends up in, like, Valencia or, you know, Valencia. Steven, Steven Ranch. It's, we live on Verdale. Verdale. Yeah, it's a little hidden uh, community up in the hills. <laughs> We have very, our, very exclusive back there. We only we have our own produce market, like our farmers market, every Saturday, which we fucking do. So fucking boom. We have twenty five megabytes per second, <laughs> all the time. <laughs> Actually, that's not true. They cut us off after we hit a certain point. No, no, we still get twenty five. It just, just comes at us slower. Oh, it's yeah. like going from. You know, like a big urethra to a small urethra, like That's a right. like a boba straw to like a McDonald's straw. I got you. I got you. Right. Your the urethra goes smaller. It condenses. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Next. Well, Des Moines that made me laugh. I fucking. <laughs> and I'm never gonna correct him. So, oh, so I want to talk about this douche lady. Okay, tell me about your. So the other day, oh, is it me? <clears throat> no, another one. <laughs> so, 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 so I was driving the other day, uh-huh. and I was, I think I was just going to go get chocolate shakes or something for the kids. It was hot. Mm-hmm. I was going to met or Jack in the Box right by our house, mm-hmm. and when you pull in our parking lot, mm-hmm. there is more speed bumps than any mm-hmm. human should ever ever have to go through like if you hit them all at 20 miles an hour everything in your car would fall off by the time you came out the other end it's like racing whoop de doos there's so many of them like as you finish one you're in another one Mm -hmm. right literally that many Mm -hmm. so what you do is you go in you hit one set and you turn to the right and you go up around and you miss them all and then you drive in the Mm drive-through and i pull in and there's this lady behind me Mm mm-hmm 
and I watch her in my mirror speed up like she's hauling ass right and i'm like oh my god right and i go around and i come down and i go to turn in and i watch her speed up and i hear her re- i hear her motor like faster down the parking lot to cut me off to make sure she got there first oh my god i was like oh my god <laughs> And her license plate was Audrey. And I was like, oh, my God, Audrey. <laughs> and I said it out loud. I go, Jesus, Audrey, what the hell? <laughs> and I just saw her looking at her mirror. She didn't say anything. But I was like looking at her in the mirror like, what in the fuck? Really? Was it that important? That's fu- like I was turning in. Uh huh. Like had I gone... Had I not paid attention, she would have taken my front end off get to go in to get that damn burger. Wasn't <laughs> so anyway, fuck you, Audrey. Fuck you. You're a bitch. I hope you choked on that motherfucking chicken sandwich. <laughs> that wasn't a chicken sandwich. If she's going there, she's Yeah. Yeah, I was the only way reason person I've ever known that was Audrey was in the little shop of horrors. Wasn't it feed me Didn't my Seymour? sister have a friend named Audrey and she's kind of wild, little out there? No. Which sister? Younger. No. Okay. I don't think so. Well, I, I yeah, so I think any anybody named Audrey's probably blood sucking uh, Venus flytrap. That's what I meant to say. Burger snaking, feed. chicken sandwich stealing, French fry eating. <laughs> bitch when it sucks on his finger to get blood it's all like like i mean there's only two cars in this whole parking lot there's no one in the drive through <laughs> and you can hear ooh, ooh. and i'm like are you fucking serious right now i was like is this really happening <laughs> it happened i was like i should test my airbags <laughs> <laughs> so stupid audrey oh, fucking, I, really audrey <laughs> <laughs> Dumb bitch, Audrey. <laughs> okay, I was like, I'll see you again, Audrey, on the road, and I got you. <laughs> well, it's just like I can't stand the name Annalise because it sounds so much like Annalise to me. <laughs> I can't. It's so. That's a real name. Yeah, there are people named Annalise, and I'm like, it's Annalise. It's like Joe Durte. It's like, no, your name is Annalise. Like just- someone named there. <laughs> I, I saw like. There was some, I'm probably stupid fake news, but it was like somebody that named their kid like Trishy Can. <laughs> so stupid. And you're like, are you for real right now? <laughs> no, he's Trisha Can. They just told you it's not for real. <laughs> <laughs> that fucking made me laugh. Oh. Um, what else? Oh, <laughs> We're, it's just going to be a Brody episode. So, Brosivos of Ding Dong <laughs> applied for the student council. Oh, shit. This is fucking hilarious. <laughs> His teacher tells him he got it. So he Congratulations. You've made, the, you've made the student council. Good job, Brody. We're proud of you. So, then he starts daydreaming. He told me this, that he daydreamed that he was going to walk out of class and be like, hey, mom, I didn't get student council. And I'd be like, oh, it's okay, buddy. And he'd be like, just kidding. And he's all, mom, then you would have hugged me and we would have been so happy. Like, he daydreamed oh, this whole fucking like thing. Like broken heart right there. So then he gets a letter <laughs> saying, sorry, we had a ton of applicants. Um, we did not get you because you did not know all of the United States where they were in their capitals. No. <laughs> so oh, I, he, I, I, I bought him for a second. <laughs> I thought I was like, no, he's been studying so hard. <laughs> was it was it Des Moines or Raleigh? Raleigh. It was Raleigh for sure. <laughs> was it Virginia or West Virginia that fucked him? Which Virginia did he get screwed on? So <laughs> he was that was so funny. mad at his teacher. He was so Oh my god, and they have been kissing his ass ass oh. let me tell you they've been kissing his ass so much i get a phone call at work the other day <laughs> this is what uh, not even a week after this has happened yeah it wasn't even a week and i get a phone call uh hi mr burnett this is uh so and so from from you know brody school right from brody school principal and i'm like uh-huh <laughs> i have brody with me and i'm like uh 
You don't All know. Right. He's the good one. I was like, who did he punch? <laughs> it's like, like Tyler, yes. Caleb, like, yes. Brody, like, no. Who did he finally lose it on and <laughs> fucking crush? I mean, he's a monstrous little 10 year old. And, and I already had an idea which kid it was, but I was like, oh, God, here we go. And, and the lady goes, well, we just wanted to tell you since Brody's been here, he's, he's helpful in whatever he does. He's mm. adorable. He's a gentleman. He's, uh, you know, manners. But, you know, like, basically just like he's the greatest little kid ever and i'm like oh well thank you i appreciate it and i'm like uh awesome can i go now (laughs) right i feel like i'm in trouble now (laughs) and then they're like all right well have a great day and i was like oh okay (laughs) bye b (laughs) bye and i was like what the fuck just happened (laughs) well then so they're kissing his ass so oh and then i was telling Derek and jenny about this as well and they're like oh my god you should have pictures where, like, you have balloons that say congratulations and I'm so proud of you. And then show it to him and be like, I had to fucking take this down so fast because I thought you were going to get it and you didn't get it. <laughs> and then I want to make him a shirt that says student council reject. <laughs> oh, my God. That would have been hilarious. <laughs> and then wear it to school. He'd get in trouble, but it would be funny. I don't think he'd get in trouble. Well, then. So. <laughs> The next day I'm driving him to school and I am an asshole. I am an asshole mom. It's what I was born to do. My mom used to pretend that she was dead. I fuck around with my kids as well. I don't know if I've ever talked about my mom pretending that she was dead. That's fucked up. But um, so I drop him off at school and I'm like, oh, wait, am I picking? probably why your dad was like, what? <laughs> quit fucking around, Robin. That's what he said. Robin, quit fucking around. Get up off the... Yeah, that's what he said and then he was like oh shit she's not fucking around that's what i said i'm like mom you were the mom who cried stroke too many times oh my god that's good well that's what i've told our son about his uh-huh. fucking whining bullshit when he's all doing that shit and there's my middle and i'm like this time i really need it. i'm like well fucking i don't hear it i don't yeah. see it we don't, don't know it. you're full of shit so my mom sometimes we were little like it's getting better every once in a while she she would like fall down to the ground and like pretend to have a seizure or she'd throw pots and pans in the kitchen and then we'd run in there and she was dead on the floor but she wasn't dead um but we didn't know that for a minute and so my mom ended up actually having a stroke and my dad was seriously like stop fucking around robin robin and then he was like oh fuck she's (laughs) it's for realsies this time so um okay dead panics like you probably drove around and didn't know where to go oh. like you're like instead of instead of getting 911 there you're like getting someone there and meeting them halfway whatever you know what i mean he, uh-huh. he gets in a panic and it's like it's like when you when when you crashed or when he crashed you in the the uh shopping uh-huh. cart and you have a scar on okay your foot. uh-huh okay uh-huh that still you still have issues with uh-huh but it's the same thing he drove you home uh-huh which i do <laughs> he did and instead of just taking you to the hospital to get you stitched up so um so i dropped brody <laughs> off so uncomfortable that that was funny <laughs> i dropped brody off and um i he gets out of the car and i'm like oh wait, wait am i picking you up late because you have student ca- oh you didn't get student counsel and he goes too early mom and i go it's too soon <laughs> That's so messed up. I know. I keep doing that to him, too. I'm like, oh, wait, do you need to? Oh, wait, you didn't get student counsel. That's That's right. So now fucking the stupid teacher was like, well, you didn't get student counsel, but you can sign up for Lego Robotics. And I'm like, fuck, you dumb, dumb, dumb bitch. I don't like you right now. No. I'm so, yeah. So she's like, we'll just put you in for Lego Robotics. And I'm like, no. Because I do not want to go to Legoland again. No. I hated that place. The only funny thing about Legoland was when the dude got stuck in Oh, my God. That was still my favorite thing. (laughs) That might be one of my favorite ever. (laughs) When the kid started pulling his legs and his flip-flops came off. (laughs) (laughs) And how fucked up is it? There's so many people that looked concerned except you and I holding each other up because we were dying. (laughs) The, The visual of a guy... Here's the visual. A oh. guy sliding down a slide. A That's tube slide. A tube slide, and he's got to be 250-ish <laughs> and probably five foot seven, nine. In shorts and flip-flops. Big boy. 
big, big heavy set boy, and he's in shorts and flip flops and a shirt, and he slides down this kid slide at the freaking Legoland, and as he gets to the bottom, he runs out of steam, and it's all like you hear it squeak to a stop, and he's stuck. There's a kid piling in behind him, and. The, and, it, and it's he's, like Wizard and he's of kinda, Oz. You can see him trying to wiggle his way out, like kicking his feet. The two kids grab his feet and trying to pull him, and his freaking flip flops fly off. One of the kids hits it on the floor. Joy and I are literally oh. holding each other up, crying oh. out loud. I mean, literally, like. 20 feet from this guy like and there's oh. everybody's looking concerned of course except for us oh. and we laughed oh my god that was the hardest i laughed at any theme park in my whole it, life and i've done not allegedly done hallucinogenics at him <laughs> during a water park maybe um allegedly but I, lego land for me was awful and if i never go there again I will be fine because it, it was the perfect place. If I had a child that had, yes, that had some special needs or like like autistic or something, yes. I think it would be absolutely perfect. For yes, them. we were not calling it Autistic Island. Um, that was not ever out of our mouth, allegedly. <laughs> and um, but there was no loud sounds, which actually is kind of good for me because loud sounds do put me in a very bad mood. Well. That's why I took you. <laughs> but there's no loud sounds. There's no peanuts. There's no gluten. Like, it's sensory deprivation on overload. Like, even the roller coasters have brakes on them, so the roller coasters don't go that fast. Oh, yeah. Like, you you guys rode that roller coaster. You're all, go. It's all... <laughs> I'm like, really? I'm walking faster than uh -huh. the roller coaster. Like, I walked back and forth. Like, I was like, oh, my God. It's going like... A creeping it it's is like, it was slower than a lazy river yeah and these kids are all ah! and i'm all <laughs> they were all <laughs> what the fuck is happening again they were all the special kids it was yes you know so fuck, God, I, a, it was awful it was, it was not for us wasn't it was it right at the beginning of the pandemic it was way before it was a year before the was pandemic. it okay because yeah. I, I think i because i remember going to supercross and no one like, fuck, man, that thing's good. It was in China, and I was like, shit, that thing's coming. Well, that's because you went in January, oh, and okay. we got shut down in March. Right. So I, I expected it. To, I mean, I saw it coming way back in December oh, like that. Caleb saw it way back in October oh, because yeah. Caleb was all, Mom, I want to start wearing a mask. And I'm all, you're not going to be that fucking weird kid wearing a mask. I'm an asshole mom. Yay. Um, and then you, now you're like, here, take your mask. Please, God, take your mask. Um, so... <laughs> That was a crazy, we went all around. That was a fun, fun thing. Um, what was a see. fun thing? Our little rant? Our little, we just went everywhere. Um, Welcome back. <laughs> hi. Was that, um, please keep your hands and hands and legs in at all times or until <laughs> the ride comes to a complete stop. We're yeah. just taking you all over the place. Oh, so, oh, that was supposed to be a bit. This isn't supposed to be a note. I don't know how that came in there. Oh, and apparently... I wrote this down because I knew you would forget, but I knew you would want to talk about it. So I have been listening to audiobooks. If you get the Libby app, L-I-B-B-Y, you can get free audiobooks from the library. And they should it sponsor us. Fucking fantastic. The Libby app, thank you. You've saved us so much money. You should you should so have you should get them to sponsor us. Money. I should. Anyway. So I had my headphones in because I was almost done with this book. And I was really tired because this last week has been a lot. Like, I need an extra day off. I'm admitting it now. So anyway, I thought John asked me a question. And I said, what? And John proceeded to laugh really, really loud <laughs> for a really long time. So I assumed he said something funny. So he said, what the fuck did you say? Which made him laugh even harder. Because apparently, John farted. Apparently, I farted a question. And, move your phone. Apparently, John farted. And because I had the headphones in my ear and I was super, super tired, I asked his fart what? And he, then it made John. to my fart and I laughed. <laughs> he laughed hard. I was all... The fuck did he say? That was so funny because he... it was timing. It was all Burr, and you're all what? And I, and I was like, <laughs> oh my god, I can't believe she just said. That. 
I, would say, I mean, if I would have had another one loaded in the chamber, it would have been great because it would have been all burn. You would have been all, I'm sorry, what? <laughs> what are you saying to me right now? I'm listening to my book. Stop mumbling. <laughs> it makes me sad when you mumble. Oh, look at that sitting on the line. Oh, she likes to see. They're good dogs. So, um, I and then I have a, a note that I don't know. Oh, you know what I noticed? It says, even blow up. Oh, that's a bit too. You know what I noticed? What? Like, I saw a couple of guys I grew up with from high school. I mean, I was never really friends with them, I guess. They just found out for the first time that you guys were friends. They're all, oh, are we the. <laughs> no, no, no. What, what, actually, we were going to go to Des Moines together. There was like guys like I played football with when we were kids, you know? Uh huh. And I was, like I said, I wasn't like the star player or anything. I was going to be a fucking. I was, <laughs> I was not barely average at best. You know, I wasn't all that great. So anyway, you know, he's There's one of the so star many players. Jokes to that, right? I now. know, but there, he was like some, like he was like one of the bigger players. He went on to play like college football and stuff. And I was like, oh, that's cool. We've never been friends on Facebook, so I fa- friended him, and we were friends for like two days. Oh shit! And I don't know if he ran through my shit or what, but all of a sudden I was like, it was all people you may know, and I was like, hey, I thought we were friends. <laughs> Oh, well, fuck you then, man. <laughs> and I did that one other time, some dude that hated me. I was like, ouch, I thought we were cool, but apparently he really, really hated me. Go ahead. Holy shit. Just, fuck you, I thought we were friends. That reminded me. I was picking up Brody today, and this fucking little five-year-old kid kept going, what's your name? And you know how bad I wanted to be all, Tony! <laughs> what? <laughs> fuck you Tony what's your name fuck you Ezekiel you oh messed my it God. up that can't... fucking shit made me laugh but I'm not I had to bite my tongue and say no why joy why didn't you not no joy because I didn't want the kid to be all fuck you Tony I just I, I was watching one where like a video where a chick was snapped and she was quitting her job at fucking Walmart uh-huh. she's like welcome to fucking day Walmart customers and Walmart staff she's like I've been here for five years. You've treated us like shit, <laughs> and I'm all over it. I'm done. I'm quitting. And you, or she doesn't say she's quitting. She like goes off and she's like, and to the to the customers, most of you have been pretty nice, but to the ones that aren't, go fuck yourselves. <laughs> you fucking piece of shit. She goes into the fucking management. You guys are pieces of shit, lazy, and you're fucking backstabbing fucks. And Linda and so and so, keep your fucking business to yourself. And then she's like, and so and so and so and so, you're cool. I appreciate you. I got nothing but love for you guys. <laughs> fuck you. I quit. And she walks out. I was like, yeah, that was badass. Well, he's just talking to someone. Do you got a reference? <laughs> <laughs> Do you need a letter of recommendation? But I was just talking to someone. You know how in the movies where somebody's all, you're fired, and they're like, fuck you, I quit. I'm like, unemployment, no. Let them fire you, you stupid bitch. It's pride. But no. I know, but it's that pride like, oh, eat a dick. <laughs> you know, the fact that you get to tell somebody to fucking choke on a fucking load or something. <laughs> what is it? Go fucking... Go suck a dick with your butthole. <gasps> Don't tell people that's ours. I'm going to use it someday. You still can. <sighs> you go suck a dick with your butthole. Fuck, well, don't yell at me. Don't, fucking, you just, don't you mm. fucking yell at me. So, um... Anyway. I... Next Monday, I'm going to go get acupuncture for the first time, and I'm very excited. And that'll be right before the podcast. Yes. So you'll be acupunctured. I will be punched and I am very excited because I need the big you. needle later. Because I did, <laughs> you're so stupid. I did a private massage after doing five on Tuesday and I went through his body with a fine tooth comb for three hours and my body is done and guess what i'm doing again tomorrow because i can't say no damn it yeah i know yeah i know you can't that's why say i was no. so popular in high school that's i wasn't popular that's why you're still po- that's why you're popular with me i wasn't popular in high school you know i only what? have two Neither more was i i was kind of a fucking i have two more notes but they were more a big fucking pussy I, I wish I could do it over again because I'd walk around and bitch slap the fuck out of motherfuckers now. I wish I could have because I was very intimidating in high school. I did not take shit. I was pretty fucking cool in high school. Like I wasn't I didn't have my groups, but I everybody knew me and nobody fucked with me. Uh, I knew it's kind of like yeah, I knew everybody and I was cool as most everybody. But remember when we went to my tenure 
And like mm-hmm. all those people were like, dude, you're in. Inti- you, she was intimidating. Like, that was fun. Actually, I had fun because I made up stories and I had those big giant dudes in our corner. I'm so still I was like, oh my God, I could pick. Dudes. I was like, I could pick fights with anybody in here and win just because I got those two behind <laughs> well, me. Well, and well, they were my. And then, and I was making them laugh. So I was like, <laughs> I got this shit. In fact, one of the big giant dudes is a cop. So we were fucking safe. I know. I we were like, so safe. I was like, dude, he could throw me to the basketball hoop from here right now. <laughs> but it was funny because I was picking up, you're like, those were the high school sweethearts. I was like, look at them, they hate they each hate other. And each they, other. they were like away from each other as far as they could get. And you were like, bitch, you know in high school they were in each other the whole time. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Now oh, like, yeah. I fucking hate you. And she's like, I'm going to go fuck Billy in the bathroom tonight. <laughs> I'm going to go lick I'm gonna, Sandra. <laughs> I'm going to go fuck the dog toucher. <laughs> Because there was a kid, you got like he—he he was a dog toucher. He was. My friend Renee told me about that. He's like, hey, just give it a handy. <laughs> had know. fur. It had fur around it. It's uh, not like I you know, was touching the tip of it. Okay. Speaking of lipsticks, <sighs> I took a little lipstick rider for the ride, and he was all excited there from the beginning. I was like, dude, put that thing away. Oh, that's fucking. Funny. I don't like puppy lipsticks. I, you know what? I haven't seen his very often, well, so it's I like, saw it. Did you? Never mind. Yeah, I grabbed it. Okay, okay. And just went after it. Like trying to start a lawnmower. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Didn't you notice the shade of red around my lips? Okay. <laughs> you're, t- you're too much. You're too much. Too Whatever. Much. And you married me. Oh, so stupid. Yeah, well, you can leave whenever you want. Bye bye. No one's holding a gun to your head. So I have two things, but they're supposed to be premises for jokes. They weren't supposed to go in my notes. One of them's even blow up dolls fart. <laughs> Which is probably funny. <laughs> Thank actually. you. And then the other one is <laughs> Trap some air and it's all <laughs> <laughs> Do you ever So I wonder if it comes out like if it pops? If it has if is it like a balloon? It's all <laughs> Okay. One of my favorite oh my god, one of my favorite jokes when I was younger. So stupid. <laughs> so stupid. So three guys get trapped in the Grand Canyon. And they can't get them out for a couple days. So they're like, is there anything we can send you, you know, besides food and water? And they're like, send us a woman. And like all the women. Yeah, we've been trapped down here for 72 hours. We ain't seen a woman in months. (laughs) (laughs) So the women are like, I'm not fucking going down there. So they send down a blow-it doll. And the first guy goes in and he's in there for like two hours. And he comes out and they're like, how was it? And he's like, fucking great. Second guy goes in. He comes out in like 20 minutes. They're like, how was it? And he's like, fucking great. Third guy goes in, comes out in like two seconds. They're like, what the fuck? And he's like, it was awful. I bit her tit. She farted and flew out the window. And I used to think that was the funniest joke ever. As a kid, ever. that was the funniest joke ever. Yes. Yeah, so stupid. And then the last note, which is going to be a funny premise, but it's not going to be funny when I say it right now, is do you ever think that you can make a sound and then you try and make a sound and you realize you can't make that sound? Like, you know how, like, people make elephant sounds and you're like, I can do that. And then you try and you're like, I can't do or like when people do yes. like, like Chewbacca, like <laughs> yeah, some people are good. Some people. <laughs> I get it. Because <laughs> I, I can't do sounds. I'm not. I can't do accents either. Um, so <laughs> I can do accents once. I've been able to do Dr. Phil perfectly once. Amy Winehouse perfectly once. Like I can do it. One so time. you have to have a recorder with you. It's like, no, I can't do it again. That was a one-time bit. Yeah, it's a one-time bit. But yeah, I was trying to make a sound the other day, and I was like, because I was watching. You're by it. yourself. You're like, I'm gonna try. <laughs> Ooh, that's a good sound. No, I watched that. a girl do something on TikTok, and I'm all, I can fucking do that. And then I was all, oh, I cannot do that. And I You're should... like, I could be a TikTok queen. <laughs> Ooh, I started writing a country song. A new one, because I write country songs every once in a while. I have a couple, but I started writing a new one, and it's called Country Music's Dead. It is dead. Yes. and anyway, but Because it's hot garbage. The now. hook right now is Country Music's Dead. It's shitty pop music instead. Oh, it's so good. It's shitty pop, it's shitty pop country instead. Uh-huh. And then it says, nobody gives a shit about Applebee's. Give me a song about Grandpa, please. When was the last rodeo? Now it's all about that red solo. Oh my god, I have so much. You're like, pss, pss, pss. yeah, you're squirting all over the place. Mm-hmm. It's awesome. Yeah, thank At you. Times. Mm-hmm. 
Oh, country music used to soothe the soul. Now it's sung by some rich asshole whose boots never touched a farm, and they use just narcissistic charm. Oh, it's going to wow. be good. Ooh, uh, uh. I've had a drink. Can you tell? I can tell. I can make that noise. <laughs> Sound like you're Twice. Ru- sounded like you were running around the corner, <laughs> and you're going too fast, and your tires are giving away. <laughs> <laughs> well, I did it. You twice. Made I did it twice. I didn't spin out. What you want now? What you what you want you want? What you want? I hate that fucking Applebee's song, by the way. That song is I don't so know which Applebee's stu- song. Applebee's. Okay, then you're not listening to enough TikToks because it's fucking all over TikTok. And I try not to listen. I, okay. I probably do know which one it is, but I don't. People that listen to this new country music, your intelligence is being killed. Stop doing it. It's bad. I agree. It is a hook. All you need is a fucking hook. And everybody's like, that's a good song. No, 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 it's not. Yeah, but... Go listen, listen to like Dwight Yoakam. A few or, years ago, they were like, Rihanna's the greatest thing ever. And you're like, okay, let me hear her song. And you're like, okay, shine like break a diamond. Uh, shine bright like a diamond. Bright yeah, like that's a all diamond. it is now. Bright like a diamond. Bright, man, those lyrics are something. Bright like a diamond. Bright like a diamond. I'm telling you, it's Dude, be- when nobody has attention spans anymore. Yeah, that's why. That's why our generations of music, the 80s and 90s, 70s, 80s, 90s, are the stuff that's 60s still 60s too. Right, right, 50s I mean, too. But even it's all better. But our generations are the ones that are still really sticking around. Okay, but don't put me in the 70s. I'm Whatever, barely in the 80s. Sorry, millennial. Oh, suck my twat. You're right at the front of the millennial. Go suck a dick with your butthole. I will suck a, the biggest, fattest one. Oh, can I watch? No. Can I put it inside? No. Ooh. You can't even be in the room. You're not nice. You know what I want to do? What is it called? Instead of putting the strap on around your waist, you put it on your head like a unicorn and peg somebody. What your head? I don't know, but I'm sure you just probably just put the strap on, belt it down to your face and be all... Mm-hmm. Well, yeah, but what is it called? Because I kind of... You know. I don't know, the unicorn? Ooh, and then you can lick their balls while you're going in. Well, wouldn't that be... Like, if you were just tonguing from behind, didn't Joey Diaz call that the pigeon? That's the pigeon, but if you have a dildo on your head, so you're in the butthole... And licking balls. And licking the balls. Just like this. I don't know what that's called. Make up your own. Call it the unicorn. The sexy unicorn. Call it the rhino. <laughs> <laughs> if it's a big fat cock, you want it to be a rhino. Look at that big thing. It's a rhino. Yeah, but you don't want to like get a bruise on your forehead. It needs to be able you to You know what I in. like best about you? What? Your forehead slap in my belly. <laughs> You're so stupid. <laughs> we should have ended this like 10 minutes ago. <laughs> we, when it was fun. We should have right, kept going. Let's go away. All right, we're going to go to Autistic Island. Right. Oh my what? God. I didn't John! do anything. What? That way should have ended. All right. Look at look at how look at how loud it got. It got so loud. All right, goodbye. Go away. Goodbye. Good day. <laughs> okay, bye. Oh, like, click, supplies. Supply. <laughs> oh my god, you racist fuck. Like what is supplies? Oh. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Never mind. Like, click. Subscribe. Tell your friends. Oh yeah, tell your don't friends. Don't be shy. Tell, Ooh, tell the homeless sh- guy. He's got a better phone than I do. Um, tell, tell somebody. Please. Tell please. somebody. We need more listens. I it's will been say. A year. I well, know we're getting there, but well, YouTube's listens have started going down, but our iTunes and our Spricker and our Spotify maintaining are going high. So we're well, cool. Yeah, but tell your friends. Let's please. One, oh, and because if you tell one friend, ooh, then they tell one ooh, friend, yeah. then they tell one ooh. friend, then and they then tell everybody one has friend. herpes. Oh wait, sorry. Okay, goodbye. Good day. Like, click, subscribe. Oh, and send us an email at whenwifegivesyoulemons at gmail dot com. Yeah, if you got a question, yeah, and, comment. Well, I'll answer it. I don't John, give a oh, fuck. Yeah. John will answer I'll all answer. emails. <laughs> Joy, will, and Joy will say this is the question and I'll answer it. Okay. Stuff. Yes, online, on air. Um, So goodbye. Good day. Goodbye. I Good even day. waited for you. Did you see that? I didn't I press it. Goodbye. Good day.